Okay, in this video, we are going to look into remote relay control using SMS text messaging. So by using your cell phone, you could send a text message to turn on or turn off this relay to control some external device. So you'll need Arduino Nano running some code and a relay. Now pin 12 of the Nano, GPIO pin 12 of the Nano, is driving this transistor which will energize the relay. Now this LED is an indicator LED and it will come on when the relay is energized. I also have an HC06 Bluetooth module and it's connected to the serial port of the Nano. So if I send the text relay on by Bluetooth to the Bluetooth module, it will, it will be sent into the serial port of the Nano and the Nano will turn on the relay. Now if I send the text relay off by Bluetooth, it will turn off the relay. So I have an app on my phone, it's called AMR Voice, and I can actually test that function out. It will actually send really on or really off by voice. So I'll pair to it, and you can see right now my Bluetooth module is blinking. So it's ready to be paired. So when I pair to it, it will go solid. So now she's solid, she's paired to my app. So now I can send the voice command, really on, should turn on my relay. Relay on. So the relay is on. Now I can send the text relay off. Relay off. And it turns off the relay. So you can see there I triggered the commands really on or really off by voice. But instead of triggering by voice, we could trigger by SMS text message using the app Arduino SMS. Okay, here's the schematic diagram of the circuit that I built on my breadboard. And you can see the Arduino Nano and the HC06 Bluetooth module. Now it's powered by 9 volts. I'm using a 9 volt battery, but you could use an AC adapter wall wart. And I'm feeding that into the VIN of the Arduino Nano through a diode, a 1N4007 diode for a reverse polarity protection. Now the voltage regulator on the Nano will feed 5 volts over to the HC06 Bluetooth module to power it up. Now the output pin 12, GPIO, is driving the indicator LED. It's also driving the transistor, a 2N3904 NPN transistor, which is driving the relay. And here's our relay contacts. And the relay is powered by the 5 volt supply coming from the Nano. Now on the serial port side, we have the serial output TX of the Nano going through a voltage divider to cut it down to 3.3 volts going into the RX of the HC06 Bluetooth module. And the TX of the Bluetooth module is fed directly into the RX of the Nano. So that's the circuit there. So we just power it up and we, we pair our app, our Arduino SMS app, to the HC06 Bluetooth module, and then we're ready to go. Okay, to control our relay by sending a text message, we need to pair the HC06 Bluetooth module to our app, to our Arduino SMS app. So we can do that now. So we'll enable Bluetooth, and we'll select Pair Devices, and then we'll select our device. And you'll see the LED on the Bluetooth module going solid. So now I can get out of the app. It doesn't matter if my screen closes on my phone. Now I can set my phone down anywhere but as long as it's within range of the Bluetooth module. I can set it down. Now when I send a, a text message to the cell phone here it's going to relay that message into the Bluetooth module. That will be sent into the Nano into, through the serial port and activate or deactivate the relay. Now on the cell phone that I'm using to send the control text message, I'm using quick response option on my cell phone, my Android cell phone, where I could enter canned uh, SMS text messages. You can see here I have really on and really off, so I just have to select that and that will, that will automatically be sent as a text message. Now you can see the really on, I have an asterisk at the beginning and a number sign at the end, that's my delimiters, so it's easier for my code on my Nano to actually pick out the really on and really off text message. Okay, here's a block diagram of our system and I'll go through the operation. So here we can see the Arduino Nano and our Bluetooth module and the serial ports are connected together and the Nano is driving the relay. Now we have a cell, cell phone in, in close proximity to the Bluetooth module within Bluetooth range and it's running the Arduino SMS app. So here we are with our cell phone miles away and we want to be able to turn on this relay. So we send the text really on with the delimiters, the asterisk and a number sign. That's being sent to this cell phone. Now when this cell phone detects it, it will send this string to the Nano. It will send the 10-digit phone number of this cell phone, 
plus the text relay on with the delimiters. And when the nano detects uh, the relay on with the delimiters, it will turn on the relay. Now the nano will send back an ACK, an acknowledgement, so the 10 digit phone number and a slash, and a relay is on that will be sent to this cell phone. So this cell phone will send this text back to this, uh, this, the controlling cell phone and it will get back relay is on. Now same if we want to turn the relay off we send relay off with, with the delimiters and then we'll get a text back relay is off, our acknowledgement. So that's how this system works. Okay I want to turn on my relay using a text message. I have it set up. You can see relay on so I'll hit send you can see my relay is on. I'll get my acknowledge back. Relay is on. So now I'll send command to turn it off. Get it set up. So you can see there relay off and hit send. Relay is off. And I'll get a acknowledgement back. Relay is off. Okay, here's the code that's running on my Nano for my SMS text message control. Now it's written in fourth because it's compact and it's interactive. So the name of my program is called SMS Control and the first thing it does is init that initializes pin 12 as an output. Then it goes into a begin again loop. This is a continuous loop. It's going to continue over and over again. And the first line is get command. So it's going to get the command either really on or really off and it's going to put it into a pad, a buffer, a 64-byte buffer. Then it's going to compare that command to uh, a string, a relay on string, and if there's a match for relay on, then pin 12 will go high and the relay will come on. Then after two seconds, it will send an on ACK back to the cell phone, saying that the relay is on. Now if, it's, if it matches the, the relay off string, then pin 12 will go low, turning off the relay. Then after two seconds, it will send the off ACK back to the, to the controlling uh, cell phone. Then it will clear the pad. It will put uh, 64 blanks into the pad. And then it will start all over again and get the command. Now this code is written in fourth, but if you want Arduino code, if you go to the app, the Arduino SMS app, and you go to the help menu, you'll get a link to some um, Arduino SMS code. Now if you want Arduino code for this Arduino SMS app, if you go into the app and go into help, you go down at the bottom, you'll see a link. And if you go to that link, you have some Arduino code so you could activate the Ar Arduino SMS app.